Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to more Let's Play Time Splitters Future Perfect for the Xbox. Uh, in the last episode, we finished out these two rows right here. This episode, we're going to start in on Dead Weight. This first level, a pox of Mox, a zone level. This level sucks. This level's so hard. Okay. The spaceport has been invaded by the dreaded Cruiser Mox, but unfortunately for the authorities, the latest Gretel combat droid just happens to be passing through on her way to... Eridani 3 for some R&R &R under the Triple Suns. Well, now they've spoiled her holiday, so it looks like she's going to be whipping their blue alien hides in return. Yeah, this level's really, really hard. Okay, for a gold, we need 36 points in 3 minutes. Silver, we need 36 points in 3 and a half minutes. And bronze, we just need 36 points. And here's Gretel. I wonder where Hansel is. Hmm... I hope y'all just heard that. That's interesting. And why is she, like, dressed to jog? Last time I checked, robots don't need cardio. Good cardio. Any cardio. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, yeah, this is a... This, have I mentioned this level sucks yet? And knowing my controller, Three, it'll probably... Two, <sighs> go out on me. Go. Yeah, it's literally you against... I don't even know, like five or six enemies. Uh, here's a dispersion gun. I forget the exact route I'm supposed to take too. But the main thing on this level, because I really don't have a strategy for it, because I've tried recording this before many times, but I just keep failing and I never actually get it recorded. Uh, one of the main strategies I've noticed, because I did clear it once, but it was on a practice and not a not an actual recording, unfortunately. But the main thing I did on that one is that there are two speed pickups in this level. And I picked both of them up and I was quick a lot. And it really helped out. That and the proximity mines, which are... Oh, that's invisibility. I don't know why you would need a cloak, but okay. We'll go with that. And there's health over there. See, I'm, I'm not 100% sure of a good strategy on this other than pick up the speed pickups and just kill them as many times as you can even though there's like five of them Jeez. see I'm, I'm it's so unfair it's one against like six or seven and why did you shoot me you can't see me I'm invisible and it's just not good see there's a speed pickup and they have all the positions see here's one I guess if you go against like their flow then you might have a better shot, maybe, instead of running behind them and chasing them the whole time. See, I couldn't even tell you where all the... Oh, you bastards. I couldn't even tell you where all the positions are. I know they're on the map, but... Oh, this sucks. See, here's one. I guarantee you I'm not going to get this on the first take, or the second, or third. So, I, uh, I'm. Just, it's probably just going to be a big fail montage. Stop it! You guys shouldn't be able to shoot. Where the hell am I? Oh, this is so dumb. Am I going backward? No? Well, maybe. Okay, I have one. Here comes the comeback right here. I have one. Oh, I am going backwards. Shit. Oh, and they just got it back, too. See, this is just stupid. There's one. The way I beat it the one time that I actually did beat it in practice, I kept picking up the speed pickups, I used the proximity mines, and I stayed in a certain area. Here are the proximity mines. I put the mines like right over here, and anybody that walks on them dies. <laughs> wow. See, it's first to 36. Yeah, there's five of them. Jeez. Okay, retry. Three. I guess I'll just cut ahead to the highlights and crap, so... Nah. I'm gonna put mines there, and I'm gonna fall off, too. That's also, that's a very key component to this strategy. Fall off the ramp, and then when you go back up, make your mines uh, deactivate. It's really, really essential. Oh, yes! Like, I got all five of them in the span of two seconds. That's fantastic. I think it's the first one, the first zone that I got, 
they actually never go for that one. I think they might actually... I mean, if you keep them in this kind of holding pattern, if you just keep alternating between these two zones right here, then uh, I think you might be alright. Oh, there's a damage pickup all the way over there, but it's kind of out of your way, so I wouldn't... I wouldn't try for it, personally, but... If you want to do it, you go right ahead. Uh, oh, there they go. There they go right there. Shit, where are they going? I think I might have this in the bag, actually. Oh, here they come, here they come. Here they come, come, here they, here they come, come. Is that how that song goes? There's a song that sounds like that. But I'm assuming there's a song that sounds like everything in the world, ever. I'm gonna win. I'm going to win. I won. In 332. 330 on the dot. Wow. Okay. Silver awarded. Most killed. Cooser Mox. That's no surprise. I never died. This is my second attempt, by the way. I'm very happy about that. Uh, accuracy. Ac accuracy. 35.9%. Favorite gun. Plasma auto rifle. Uh, got a silver. Fantastic. I think the time limit is four minutes. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I went 24-0. That's pretty good. And I kit wow. Five, 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 and four. That's okay. Most accurate, yep. Alright, what do we get? Reward us, game. Reward us. No, it's come, baby, come, baby, baby, come, come. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, new character, Kuzermox, which is exactly who we kept killing. Killed twenty four times. New cheat, small heads. I wonder if you have small heads and big heads on at the same time, if they'll cancel out and they'll be regular heads. It's an interesting thought. Okay, so we unlocked Rumble in the Jungle uh, elimination level. On the next episode, we're going to tackle that one, okay? So until then, I'm Broken Champion. We're done here.